We have breaking news on your fast track to seven. Police continue to search for the man who jumped into the Red River and has not been seen since yesterday afternoon. The Valley Today's JC Dodd joins us live in East Grand Forks with the latest on this search. Good morning, JC. Jordan, yes, law enforcement tell me the search will continue in about an hour. They will be back here where I'm standing in East Grand Forks along the Red River near the Surly Bridge looking for the man who jumped into the Red River yesterday afternoon. So I want to walk you through everything we know about the situation so far. Um, it started when East Grand Forks police responded to a house about 10 minutes from where I'm standing now um, for an unwanted person. Police made contact with that person and he told them he was heading back to Grand Forks. Now about a half hour later, um, police responded to a report of that same man jumping into the Red River. So um, rescue efforts began. They threw him a buoy and a life jacket. Um, unfortunately, he was not able to grab onto them. And unfortunately, a short time later, they did not see him. So they have not seen him since then. That was around 4.30 yesterday afternoon. A search went on all night until around 10 last night. And again, Jordan will pick up in about an hour at 8 a.m. They will be back out here. Grand Forks Water Rescue will be here. Polk County Sheriff's Office as well looking for this man. So we'll be here throughout the morning bringing you the latest from the scene in East Grand Forks. All right, and we'll stay there. J.C. Dodd reporting live in East Grand Forks this morning. Thank you.